Hey everyone, in this video I want to show you how to set up a wearable collection from scratch. First, in order to submit a collection to a marketplace, you will need some Polygon Mana. I already have some Polygon Mana in my wallet, but if you don't own any Polygon Mana, you can access to account.decentran.org and buy some using Transac. If you already own Mana, you can simply swap it clicking here. Take into account that this operation consists of two steps. One is free and for the other one you will need some Ethereum to pay the gas fees for the transaction. Let's create the collection now. First, I will need to create a folder that contains all the items. I'm going to name my collection Fashion Spring 2022. Then I'm going to import my wearables to the collection. You can edit representation, name, add rarity, category and add a custom thumbnail if you wish. I'm going to add a custom thumbnail because I think it looks better. Now I'm going to repeat the process with all of my wearables. One of my wearables have two representations, so I'm going to add the female representation first and adding the male representation later using the editor. Once you import all the wearables to the collection, you can check and edit the properties in this section. You can edit name, add a description, change rarity, add replaces and heights and add tags. In this particular case, I'm going to hide lower body because my wearable already has the lower body attached to it. Also, you're going to notice that the male representation is not visible. That's because we only add the female representation during the first step. To add the other one, go to these three dots and click add male representation choosing the correspondent shlb file. Once we do this, the wearable is going to work for both shapes. You can select different modes using the tool to check if the wearables have some undesired skin deformations or clipping issues. Once you finish with the editing of the wearables, you can go to the general tab of the collection and set the price to your items. Before submitting your collection, it's important to do a final overview using the See in Work feature and corroborate that the wearables work as expected using the Explorer. For this, you will need to set up your MetaMask in Robstan. Now, entering to the backpack, we are going to see that the wearables appear under collectibles. Select them to check how they behave in Warp and test them using different animations. After checking that everything works properly, go back to the builder changing the MetaMask to mainnet again. To submit, just click here. Before submitting the collection, remember, you cannot change the name of the collection, rarity or either add or remove items of the collection after this step. To continue, you will need to authorize the collection manager contract to operate MANA on your behalf. This transaction has no cost. Click Proceed to see the overview of the collection. After this, please carefully read the content policy and agree with the terms and conditions entering your email. Click on Publish and a MetaMask pop-up is going to appear. Sign the transaction to finalize the submission of the collection. A specialized committee of curators is going to review that the collection follows all the guidelines and corroborate that the wearables don't have any technical issue. Once that the committee approved the collection, you are going to see that the items have a green dot. This means that the collection is active to put your wearables on sale. When toggling on sale, the items will appear on the marketplace for other people to buy. Also, you can mint the items individually and managers to administrate and edit the collection and give minting powers to other addresses. Thanks for watching.